Wizard, at last you have come! Any longer and I may have perished under the weight of this disrespect. You see, my friend, I have been burgled. A priceless family heirloom was stolen by my most archest of nemesis, my evil twin brother, Roberto. He's wanted the item since we were cults. I tried to confront the fiend, but he secured himself behind a wooden skeleton lock. A powerful word I thought only a legend. Until now. I'm certain there's a way to unlock the boning barrier, but I'm too busy training new students in the combative arts to do the research myself. However, I did hear there's a new assistant in the library whose focus is in the skeleton locks and keys. Could I impose upon you to consult him? Oh, can I help you? Diego the Duel Master seeks information about a wooden skeleton lock? Why, that happens to be my field of expertise. Skeleton locks are enchanted doors that can only be opened by a corresponding key. Thus, Diego's wooden lock requires a wooden skeleton key. But those keys are typically quite difficult to come by, coveted as they are by what I call bad folk, and they shatter after only one use. Fortunately for you, I have a wooden skeleton key I can part with if you take this keyring with you on your adventures. The keyring detects nearby skeleton keys and sends data back to me for my continuing research. <laughs> Plus, it will mark your map with key locations. Well, I bid you and Diego good luck with whatever waits behind that wooden skeleton lock. I'm counting on you to explore the entire spiral. <laughs> You're back! What did the librarian's assistant say? Mm, we need a wooden skeleton key? Of course! Curse this bad luck! What's that? The librarian's assistant gave you a wooden skeleton key? I knew you'd come through for me! That's why I hate to beg another favor of you. Will you duel Roberto and recover my precious heirloom? Let me explain. As much as I would love to battle my brother, honor forbids it. You see, Roberto and I both made an oath to our mother on her deathbed that we would never take up arms against family, so I cannot fight him. However, we also made an oath to our father on his deathbed that we never back down from a challenge, so I must fight him. You see my difficulty, huh? Roberto stole the heirloom knowing I'd be unable to personally retaliate. But there is no dishonor if I send a proxy. Especially not if that proxy is my most prized pupil who learned everything they know about dueling from me! Ha <laughs> ha! Will you do it? Thank you, my friend. You can find Roberto in his hidden lair. I'll mark your map. You've lobbed right into my trap, my foolish bra- Wait, you are not my brother. Does that coward, Diego, send a child to fight his battles? So be it! Enough! Here, give the baby his toy back. I only stole it to irk him. 
But it's no fun if I don't get to see the look on his stupid face. Besides, he clearly isn't lucky at all. Couldn't even help me defeat a lowly whelp like you. Just take that piece of junk and get out! Get out of here! You've returned with my great grandsire's lucky unicorn shoe! I know that scoundrel Roberto would be no match for my favorite pupil. It's a good thing the librarian's assistant that no one had ever heard of before literally had the key to solving this problem, no? <laughs> Indeed! <laughs> Just see, my friend, this unicorn shoe brings luck to everyone! Well, for everyone but Roberto, that is. <laughs> hey, thank you again! <laughs>